Matthew chapter 1. This is a record of the ancestors of Jesus the Messiah, a descendant of King David and of Abraham. Abraham was the father of Isaac. Isaac was the father of Jacob. Jacob was the father of Judah and his brothers. Judah was the father of Perez and Zerah. Their mother was Tamar. Perez was the father of Hezron. Hezron was the father of Ram. Ram was the father of Aminadab. Aminadab was the father of Nashon. Nashon was the father of Salmon. Salmon was the father of Boaz. His mother was Rehab. Boaz was the father of Obed. His mother was Ruth. Obed was the father of Jesse. Jesse was the father of King David. David was the father of Solomon. His mother was Bathsheba, the widow of Uriah. Solomon was the father of Rehoboam. Rehoboam was the father of Abijah. Abijah was the father of Asaph. Asaph was the father of Jehoshaphat. Jehoshaphat was the father of Jehoram. Jehoram was the father of Uzziah. Uzziah was the father of Jotham. Jotham was the father of Ahaz. Ahaz was the father of Hezekiah. Hezekiah was the father of Manasseh. Manasseh was the father of Amos. Amos was the father of Josiah. Josiah was the father of Jehoiachin and his brothers born at the time of the exile to Babylon. After the Babylonian exile, Jehoiachin was the father of Shealtiel. Shealtiel was the father of Zerubbabel. Zerubbabel was the father of Abiud. Abiud was the father of Eliakim. Eliakim was the father of Azor. Azor was the father of Zadok. Zadok was the father of Achim. Achim was the father of Eliud. Eliud was the father of Eleazar. Eleazar was the father of Mathan. Mathan was the father of Jacob. Jacob was the father of Joseph, the husband of Mary. Mary was the mother of Jesus, who is called the Messiah. All those listed above include 14 generations from Abraham to King David, and 14 from David's time to the Babylonian exile, and 14 from the Babylonian exile to the Messiah. Now this is how Jesus the Messiah was born. His mother Mary was engaged to be married to Joseph, but while she was still a virgin, she became pregnant by the Holy Spirit. Joseph, her fiancé, being a just man, decided to break the engagement quietly so as not to disgrace her publicly. As he considered this, he fell asleep, and an angel of the Lord appeared to him in a dream. Joseph, son of David, the angel said, Do not be afraid to go ahead with your marriage to Mary, for the child within her has been conceived by the Holy Spirit. She will have a son, and you are to name him Jesus for he will save his people from their sins. All of this happened to fulfill the Lord's message through his prophet. Look, the virgin will conceive a child. She will give birth to a son, and he will be called Emmanuel, meaning God is with us. When Joseph woke up, he did what the angel of the Lord commanded. He brought Mary home to be his wife. But she remained a virgin until her son was born, and Joseph named him Jesus.